Hello my Soccer Universe for another uh, jersey collection video and I'll show you another shirt as, as I have my English background still still up I decided yeah let's go for another one and today I decided to go for my first Arsenal away jersey one that was bound to happen uh, in many ways I always had a certain liking for art art Arsenal especially on when you know under the invincible years and so on and uh, they played a nice style of football. I remember that when I got this one in 2001 uh, at Highbury itself, it was kind of, you know, I got Chelsea, which was my fav favorite team at the time in England. I got Spurs, but Arsenal, that was the London team at the moment. I have changed my stance on that, but, you know, uh, just to give you a, a way how I always thought about Arsenal, uh, who is the London team? Yeah, it was kind of Arsenal. Which is weird, but you know, it was also, I think, the first London team where I was aware, that I heard of, that I was aware that they uh, were a London team. That was when they played in the Champions League qualification against Austria Vienna, and I think they beat them 6 1 or something like that. So, you know, there is, for me, Ar Arsenal was always kind of a. a uh, a, a prime, uh, a one of the prime teams, and I was very happy to pick up this one. But I, I when I started the channel, I always thought, and I, it was, I always want to have an Arsenal away jersey. And for me, there were only two colors that I could. I mean, away jersey for Arsenal for me was always yellow. So I always want to have a yellow one. But I remember that around this time they also had this beautiful navy uh, with a little bit yellow in uh, in their jersey. That I think my brother actually at least had with Thierry Henry on the back. Yeah, I wish we still. I'm not sure if he still has it, but that that was another really nice jersey. But I said I want to go for a yellow Arsenal jersey. Now I have to say that this 2010 to 13 is maybe not the perfect one, eh, but I think it was one that I always had an eye on because it seemed achievable. I mean, some some of the other yellow ones that were released, they were either uh, very old, hence very expensive. This one cost me all of 15 euros, uh, or maybe 20, 15 or 20. It was not, it, it, it was not expensive. And I gotta say, um, I always liked it, although it's not your typical Arsenal jersey. I also want to get one with the new crest, although I prefer the old style a whole lot better. But you know, the new one, I, I like that the cannon is pointing the other way. There's something to it, but it's, I think it's it's time for a redo for our Arsenal. Just have the cannon, maybe. Uh, but it was one that you know I grew now accustomed to. But I know the first time I saw it was kind of meh, yeah, not really nice. Especially the the navy, the uh, the the blue doesn't really fit with the rest of the jersey here. But yeah, so be it. It is a nice jersey. I got that. I, I I gotta say I like the red current, which is kind of <laughs> although it was a fluke. The last one, uh, the last home jersey to to Hi Highbury, at Highbury, of course, had this color too. So I guess Nike was pushing it at the time. Um, it has the Fly Emirates sponsor, which you know uh, is also quite uh, interesting and, and nice for Arsenal jersey. It's one of the more beautiful sponsors out there. I have, to, I have to say, even though it's two, two lines, I add, add a certain elegance to it. Um, but lastly, what I really like about it, it is, of course, reminds me, although it was uh, then used already as a third jersey, that this was worn when Milan played Arsenal, and it was the San Siro game. I think my daughter just was born, and they, uh, Milan won 4 0, and Arsenal were wearing these jerseys. And yeah, I have to, and that actually prompted me to buy the home jersey at the time. And so now I have the other jersey as well. That Milan then almost botched this one is a completely different story. But yeah, uh, that was the memory. But I think they also played Barcelona in this one uh, early on. So I mean, uh, this is, it was quite an interesting time. I totally love the pinstriping on this one. Uh, I'm not sure if the camera will pick it up, but um, this stripe and this stripe and this stripe, there is a slight ventilation thing going on. I uh, have to get maybe out of the glare. So this is a very interesting part of that shirt. Um, I have to say the stitching here is a little bit weird. <laughs> and it's this, it goes double stitches here, then it stops here. I, I do like the thick sleeve cuffs. And then, yeah, on the back, I mean, it's the same thing in many ways. And then it just says Arsenal up top. The one bone of contention maybe is, do you see this line here? 
it's the same material, but the, it maybe looks a little bit weird. But other than that, I have to say, I was very happy when I had when I found this one. Yes, it would be really nice to get now uh, one that's a little bit more, um, how to say, uh, a little bit more Arsenal meaning um, instead of having yellow and this dark red, maybe in navy, but it's not a high priority for me. And this was the one that I wanted to go for. So in any case, please let me know what you think about this jersey. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more. And I will talk to you soon. Bye. I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will keep you updated on all the things that are rotating in my soccer universe. And with that, I'm going to wish you a wonderful day.